Hey guys, it's Megan and welcome to today's video. It's the Dollar Tree haul because you know those are my favorite to film and just to do, period, because I'm obsessed with Dollar Tree. If you've watched my channel for long, you know my obsession with Dollar Tree. And if you haven't and you're new to my channel and you love Dollar Tree, hit the subscribe button because I am always doing Dollar Tree hauls and shop with me's and all that fun stuff. So let's hop into the things that I got at the Dollar Tree. These are like two trips combined into one. My daughter and I were sick last week with this stupid flu, so I didn't get to put up of any video last week. So I'm here today with a video for you showing the things that I got. So let's get into it. The first thing that I got are these white roses. I thought these were so pretty. I love the way that they look. Like they just look pretty i mean obviously they don't look completely real but they're nice and full and i really just was drawn to them i don't know why but, and i knew i wanted white flowers and i just had to pick them up i'm always impressed not always i take the back i'm mostly impressed with dollar tree floral i think they have so much great floral a lot of the times and this was no exception this is another floral that i got this was like in their valentine stuff but what I love about these roses as opposed to like the regular pink ones that they had and the red ones is that it's the trim, it's like trimmed in the darker pink and then it has the lighter pink and I just think it's so pretty like that. It's just different than all the other ones that I saw and I was drawn to it so I got a few of those. I also picked up this floral foam. Oh, I was looking for the like circle ones and I went to a couple different Dollar Trees and I could not find the darn circle ones. So I got this shape to see if I can make it work. I have a DIY in mind. I'm so bummed that I didn't get to do any of the Valentine's Day DIYs that I wanted to do, but time just got away from me. The sickness got to me and I couldn't, but I've got Easter ones in mind that and spring ones. So I'm excited to start those. So these, I got two of them, that's for that. I also got these little candlesticks for um, the DIY that I have in mind. So hopefully that'll work out. We'll see, we'll see. I'm not the best DIYer, but I'm working on it because I really enjoy it. And I also got, I don't know why I only got one of these, but I got this LED pillar light. I just love these. I love the little um, tea light ones too. I use those all the time. And I think they're just fantastic. It's so much better than having to like change them out all the time with, um, you know, lighting it and stuff. And you don't have to worry about wax dripping, which is, I hate when that happens and it ruins something. I also got these heavy duty storage bags. It comes two in a pack. These are so great for so many things. Lately, I've been trying to figure out a new way to store my seasonal floral and I've been using these bags for them and it seems to be working out really nice so they don't get dusty and stuff and I can keep them out organized with the colors and all that stuff. So that's a great way to use these. But I also got these because my daughter, for the past few months, every time I wear an outfit that she really likes, she always says like, mom, will you save that for me so that when I get older, I can wear that? And I'm always like, sure. And now she said it a bunch of different times to a lot of different things. And there's some things that I was going through my closet and I kind of wanted to get rid of, but I knew that she had said that she wanted it. So I am putting all of those clothes to the side and I'm going to give them to her when she like turns 13, 14, 15, whatever I think she'll fit into them. And who knows if she will actually wear them or not. I have no idea. I would think it would have been cool if my mom did that for me, but we'll see if she'll think she thinks it's still cool. So long story short, I got these to store the clothes that I'm going to be saving for her for when she gets older. She's six, so we still have a while. Um, but yeah, so that's why I got those. And then I also got these little snack containers. These are frozen ones. My daughter's really not into frozen anymore, but her favorite color is purple. And I don't know where these go. I use them in her lunches to put like fruit and um, they just disappear on me. So I saw these and I got them. Another thing that I got, this not a very exciting item, but it's the moisture eliminator. I've hauled these before. 
These work really well. If you have an area in your house that tends to get a lot of like dampness and moisture, I ha in my bathroom and in my closet, it I don't know why it does, but it just gets a lot, it holds moisture in there. And I didn't use them for a while, like I ran out or got done with and I hadn't replaced it and I could feel the difference. So I got another one of these to put back in. So if you have that issue, try these out. I don't know how much they cost at like Walmart or Target, so I don't know if the price is you know that much different but for a dollar and it works really well so if you need that that's a good find ah here's the other i knew i got two of these i was like why would i have just gotten one i got two and then another thing that i got is this dry erase um eraser and it's just for my daughter she has a little dry erase board and we always are just using like a towel so i just got her a little eraser because i thought she would think that's fun the next thing I got were some baskets. I love these. This one's the pink one and this one's the purple, obviously. And I just love the designs on these. They do such a great job with them. They didn't have the one that I was actually hunting for, which is more of like the paper tray. Um, I had somewhere I wanted to use that, but I know I can use these in my daughter's bathroom, so I got these, but I'm on the hunt to find more in like the other shapes and sizes. My Dollar Tree really didn't have, either they had a bunch of spring uh, baskets and stuff and they're already sold out, which I hope not, or they just haven't gotten their shipment in, which I'm, fingers crossed, that's the case. But I do definitely like these a lot and there's so many uses for these baskets and I like them because they're not just like a plain basket, they're visually appealing. Okay, another thing that I got that's just kind of boring, cotton rounds, but I always get them from there. They're great. And I also got these Huggies wipes. My daughter is definitely not in diapers anymore or anything like that, but I like to carry baby wipes in my car. And um, just for, you can use baby wipes for so many things. And I loved the design of this. I just think this is such a cute design. I'm a Disney lover. If you know me, you know I love Disney. I got married at Disney. So I just, these I just had to get. And I was impressed. I mean, there, I don't know how many is in here, but it's a pretty big pack. Well, 32. So I don't know, but I got them. I also got this little water bottle thing. If you guys have um, gotten this, let me know how it works for you. I actually got this to make a DIY um, veggie spray to like clean off your veggies and fruits and stuff before you use them or eat them. Um, so I, I've heard that these work better than like the cleaning ones, but I've yet to try it so I'm going to try it and if it does work sprays well my daughter when she gets ready for school she will go in there and she'll take like turn the sink on and like put water down and like all this and I'm like well maybe I should just get her a little water spray bottle and she could just spray it I don't know so if this works well I'm going to probably pick up another one but definitely let me know if you've used these and how it works and also how what I'm sure there's tons on Pinterest and I've kind of seen them and I, but I've never really pinned any. How do you make a DIY like a veggie wash? I was gonna buy one the other day in the store from the Honest Company but it was kind of expensive. I'm like, I'm sure I can make this on my own cheaper but I don't really know what you put in it because I've always just used water but now that I think about it, I'm like, I should probably use something more than just water. So if any of you have a little good DIY veggie wash, fruit wash kind of spray thing idea, leave it in the comments below and let me know, please. Okay, I had to get this. I've seen people haul this before. I think I've actually bought one of these in the past, but I have no idea where I went. And I think I actually bought it for my daughter. But when I saw this again, I had to get it because I really want to use it when I'm writing my planner. I've been doing so much better with my planner and writing things down. I still have to get to decorating it, but I'm in the process of getting there. And I just wanted a cute pen to write in. These are just so cute. I just love it so much. Okay, you're gonna think I'm ridiculous that I bought this. And it was a total impulse splurge. Not splurge, because it was only a dollar. Total impulse buy, that's what I was going for. Look at these like bag clips. These little lips, oh my God, I couldn't resist them. That's another thing, I don't know where they go. I use clothes pens most of the time, but when I saw these with the pink lips and the little heart up here, 
I had to get them. I just think they're too cute. And I think my daughter will think they're super cute too. So I'm excited to use these. If anyone else has used these, do they do they break on you? Or they, they seem pretty sturdy. So hopefully they'll be good. I have looked for this for so long in the pink and I hadn't been able to find it until now. I got this pink lighter for obviously lighting things. I love lighting candles and I just think it is so darn cute. I had to get it. I had to get it. I just, I don't know. I don't know how well it works and how long it'll last me for. If any of you guys have gotten this one, does it, is it comparable? Is it comparable, comparable? I don't ever know. To the longer ones that they have, which is what I usually always get at Dollar Tree, but let me know if you have used this and how it holds up for you. Um, but just cuteness factor alone, I love it. I was browsing their makeup area and I saw these and I don't feel like I've seen these before. This I got is the LA Colors All-in-One Makeup Stick in Pink Satin. And I love these little like crayon sticks. They're so easy to use when you just want to throw one in your purse or just throw one on and I thought the color looked really pretty so I'm excited to use these. This and I think this is the only color they had. I was looking for other colors. Maybe not. I don't know, but I'm gonna pick some up more up if it works well. If any of you guys have used this, let me know how this worked out for you. I also stumbled on these, these LA Colors Color Balm Lip Color Plus Balm in One. They had a bunch of colors. I got the color Kapow, which is a real like purple color, and then the color Smooch, which is a much more pinky color. And I really was drawn to these. I have no idea how they work. And they had like a red, they had an orange, they had a super bright pink. And depending on like how pigmented they are, cause the orange was like super orange, but I'm guessing it doesn't come off that orange. So let me know if you guys have used these and how they work for you. And um, I'm excited to try them out though. I also picked up a couple for my daughter too. So, cause she is just so into wearing lipstick. She always wants to have some lipstick on. So I thought this would be a good little thing for her for the days that she wants to wear some lipstick. I also got this um, sassy and chic nail brush. I have grown my nails out. Gosh, I don't know when I started growing them out. Like. October maybe maybe it was after then but I had, was a nail biter my entire life and then one day I just decided I don't want to bite my nails anymore I want to have long nails I want them to just to look pretty and I want to get them done at the salon and just get them like painted so these are I do go to the salon and get like dip powder put on to make them stronger but um, they are my real nails and so I'm trying to take care of them better and like scrub underneath because they get so dirty under there. So I thought that this nail brush would be helpful to like clean underneath. So I'm going to give this a whirl and see how it works out. And last but not least, I think is my favorite thing. Ah! Look at this shower cap. Oh my gosh. When I saw this, I felt like I hit the jackpot. I needed a new shower cap. I have no idea where mine went and I can't, when I'm in the shower, I like to take a hot shower and I can't wash my hair in hot water or else the color will fade out so quick. So I tend to just take a lot of baths and then I wash my hair like over the bathtub every time I wash my hair for the most part, unless I want to take like, a cold shower. Um, so I wanted to take some hot showers again. So I needed a shower and this shower cap was so cute, is so cute. I hope that it actually keeps my hair dry, but the lips on it and all the different lipstick colors is so unbelievably cute. If you like wearing a shower cap, you've got to go to Dollar Tree and find this because how could you resist this shower cap? It's just so cute. So that is it for my Dollar Tree haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments below, what was your favorite thing I hauled? Let me know if you've used any of the products that I have questions about. If you have a good veggie spray fruit wash thing, let me know that too. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, I would love for you to hit the subscribe button. And I think that's it for today. I hope you guys all have an amazing rest of your day and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.